What was Prabhupada's idea of Madhukari? Very different idea. Hmm? He wanted to go to America. Hmm? Now, as I said, many Indian boys want to go to America. Hmm? But he had a very different idea about this. <coughs> he wanted to go to America to change it, to bring Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's teachings. Hmm? And so he would try to find out about America while he was living as a beggar. Hmm? He would uh, take his meals at the Radhadamada temple and beg whatever money he could get he would spend on, on, on preaching, printing his Back to Godhead magazine, taking the train to Delhi, getting a loan to print the magazine, trying to sell it in the tea shops, and looking through garbage cans, hmm. not to find something to eat, but to find some, some information about the world. Hmm? Somebody left a newspaper like they do in, in the coffee shop at Starbucks, so you come and take it, you don't have to buy the paper. Hmm? Uh, you don't have too much of an identity crisis. <laughs> and and uh, so Prabhupada would take the newspaper, so then he used to find um, tracts, Jehovah's Witness tracts and from Christian preaching. Hmm? Where he would get information about America, hmm? what it was like over there, what how the religious people were thinking. Naturally, you think you go to the religious people, and they're Christians, and this is how they preach, and this is how they think. Hmm? So this was his background. This was his raga. Meanwhile, other people living in Vrindavan, reading the Goswami Shastras, doing Madhukari, and, and so on, and Prabhupada is trying to find about any information he can about America, and reading the religious tracts and so forth. This was his rag. This was his enthusiasm. Hmm? People think, what kind of, what is it? He's not doing, what, meaning rag bhakti? What is this? Hmm? Reading the newspapers? Hmm? Trying to find out information about America? Hmm? Making a magazine? Hmm? Going to Delhi? Hmm? This was, would be uh, mind-boggling. It would be dismissed hmm, by the, many of the so-called Tyagis there in Vrindavan. No, but this is how he preoccupied himself. And then to get a ticket to America, see what he did. Hmm? Went and sat at the Sumati Moraji's on her lawn <laughs> you know what a lawn is in india i mean it's like very rare hmm? sat on the lawn and did his nam nam bhajan there with a desire to go to america how inappropriate he's doing nam bhajan with a desire to get a ticket to go to america that's how it could be looked at hmm? uh, but she knew he was a sadhu she didn't want him to go for fear of his health she said no you should stay in vrindavan retire your 70 years old, this is the last part of her life, this is time for bhajan, Maharaj. Hmm? <laughs> this is his bhajan. Kirtana prabhave, smarana svabhave. Hmm? Hmm? So she had to acquiesce, give him passage as a piece of cargo hmm? on her boat, steamer, the Jaladutta, and he went and aboard the ship across the ocean. So many difficulties, they didn't stop there. Hmm? So many difficulties, health difficulties, the game, heart attack, hmm? seasickness, hmm? and so forth. On his uh, appearance day here, we read from that book that Chaitanya kindly gave to me, of Prabhupada's handwriting and so forth, on the Jaladutta's diary on the boat. Hmm? Very nice publication. And there again it surfaced. Hmm? Tomorrow Milane Bhai, Abar She Shukopai, Gucharani Guridin Bor. Banekai Lutoputi, Banekai Chutaputi, what is it? Banekai Chutta Kotavane Chutta Chutti, Banekai Lutoputi, Sedin Kobehobe Mor. This influence of Nitin under arm. Shiramar said, At that time, it is my consideration. On the boat, crossing the ocean, he had completely emptied himself out, completely. Such full Sharanagata, Krishna will maintain me. Such full surrender that Nityananda Prabhu filled him up with that avish, that power to do that kind of Guru Seva. In that prayer, he prayed for that. My Gurudev, give me the power 
You are the representative of Radharani, and it's known throughout the world, my dear Krishna, that if Radharani is pleased with you, then your life will become pious. Hmm? If Radharani is pleased with you, my dear friend Krishna, that will be good for you. This is the kind of consultation that Krishna takes from people like, friends like Subal, Madhu Mangal. They're expert in giving this kind of counsel to Krishna in his moments of, of uh, separation. He's, all, he's feeling separation, but sometimes it's augmented. He's thinking of her constantly, but then sees something that overtly reminds him of her. And he says, oh, Subal, do the japa, sing uh, Radhanam. Hmm? Hmm? What is that statement? Hmm. Godopokari. Hmm? Smriti Dapriyanam. Hmm? The best friend, Krishna says, the best friend is one who reminds one of his beloved at moments of separation. So, Sri Dharma says, at this time, writing this prayer, thinking like this, when I will again meet Krishna, my friend, when I will sport with him in the forest, hmm? Gocharani, Guridhinbo, herding cows, all these things. Hmm? This, was his, this was his Smarana Swabhave, hmm? from his Kirtana Prabhave, from his enthusiasm for Kirtan, his determination for Kirtan. This is coming fully in his heart. Hmm? And it's in on the Prabhu giving him the power. This is a preaching prayer, but his bhajan prayer also. See how that combined. Hmm? He's asking for power to preach. Hmm? And with very good reasoning, hmm? he appeals to Krishna, my dear friend. Hmm? It will be good for you if Radharani is pleased, don't you think? Oh, yes, yes, yes. And... My Gurudev is representing Radharani's group, so she has asked me to preach. So you have to give me the power. Hmm? This is a way to attract Krishna's attention. Did he give him the power? There are all the evidence of that hmm? in such a big way. Hmm? Then he touched the shores of America. Hmm? Hmm. And that came campaign began. Hmm? Such wide preaching. In America. So here's a young Indian boy wanted to go to America. <laughs> As I began. Hmm? He arrived. But he never changed his color. He changed our color. Hmm? So many young boys and girls giving up their material lives for his uh, ideal Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's mission. Such power he had. 